This LOS is explain the requirements for segment reporting and calculate and interpret segment ratios. Business and geographic segments, segment reporting requirements. An operating segment is defined as a component of a company, A, that engages in activities that may generate revenue and create expenses, including a startup segment that has yet to earn revenues, B, whose results are regularly reviewed by the company's senior management, and C, for which discrete financial information is available. That's the uh, important key point. A company must disclose separate information about any operating segment, which means certain quantitative criteria, namely the segment con constitutes 10% or more of the combined operating segment's revenue, asset, or profit. For purposes of determining whether a segment constitutes 10% or more of combined profits or losses, the criteria is expressed in terms of the absolute value of the segment's profit or loss as a percentage the greater of one, the combined profits of all profitable segments, and two, the absolute amount of the combined losses of all loss-making segments. So there's a little bit of um, uh, rules there, quantitative rules with regards to the 10% or more of the operating segments, revenues, assets, or profit, or in some case losses. So here we have the segment ratios. Again, we're gonna have a numerator and denominator. Segment margin is just the segment profit or loss divided by the revenue. Segment turnover, so these are the same as our regular ratios, but now we're just looking at the segment. So turnover is re revenue over assets. We know that, asset turnover. We can change that to number of days as well. Segment ROA is the segment profit or loss divided by the assets, return on assets. And the segment debt ratio would be the seg uh, segment liabilities divided by the segment assets, okay? And that's the only slide for this LOS. Thank you.